What's up, everybody? It's Brian with you from the Game Cabinet. We are playing some more Gears Tactics. We are about to do another main mission, which is kind of a side mission. We're we're training our people. I so here's the thing. Like, I'm at this weird spot where it's like, do I want to use our main people and get them XP, or would I rather use some of our B characters just to level them up? And I'm not quite sure. Let's actually look here. So four, five, three, 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 two, two, two. I mean, these guys I almost don't care about. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I kind of just care about these four plus these four. Um, I think I will go ahead and run with uh, our new support on this mission. We don't want Augustus on this because that's two vanguards. Let, let's look at this. So I don't want two vanguards. So Augustus, go ahead and get removed. And I think essentially this is the same team. They just replaced Sid with Gabe. Uh, or Gabe with Sid, rather. So then, like I said, I want another support. I don't want that other heavy, though. Do we want to use Marcella here as well? She's new. She's not. What about removing you with our backup heavy? And taking on Lori. I mean, you're the same level, so let's just keep Emily until she gets a little bit higher level. Because, I mean, getting some extra levels here would be really nice. Get them to level 4 and stuff like that. Okay, so with that, let's go ahead and start adjusting everything. I don't know why I went there. Uh, primary weapon. I would love just to switch and give you uh, the weapon for... Uh, actually, I'll keep the crit chance. Give you Gabe's a weapon. That would just be so nice. <sighs> I'm going to leave you on this just so I don't have to go back and change this later, I think. <laughs> Which is kind of lazy. This one doesn't give you diagnose, but it gives you but it gives you a lot of accuracy. So it's rare. I'll give that to you. That's fine. And then, sure, have the hair trigger. Oh, no, no. Do the 15 damage. That's, yeah. Yeah, that's great. And then you're brand new, so we've not colored you yet. Um about dark brown we've not really done any dark brown and let's do some patterns here it's a pink pattern actually i really like that that looks kind of baller man i dig it i dig it secondary we do want to give you one of the better weapons um we're not taking lori we said so i'll give you lori's and i don't care about coloring that you are fine on the grenades hat we still only have the four hats so we want to take whichever hat gabe had which is not that one not that one, that one, sure. And you're on blue colors, I don't like that. I kinda like the idea. So these are actually the secondary colors I think I'm just now realizing. Uh, and then let's go patterns. And I like the danger zone. And definitely show that helmet cause that is just baller. Uh, is there anything here? Destroyer vest, untraceable, blitz. 30 health, untraceable. I don't remember. Gabe is using this one, which is stabilizers. Shots and cover give some person. Yeah, you know what? I'll give you this one. You can take untraceable. We'll make you a little more. Like, if she has her own stuff, I'm okay with that. Because then we don't have to worry about switching every single time. Um, Obviously, that only works if we have good enough stuff for her to actually have. And as of now, it seems like, yeah, we do. So. All right, I'm fine with that. And then let's see legs. Heavyweight, damage reduction, self-repair, health, or movement and invasion. I think I'm okay with the destroyer leg guards. Yeah, I think I'm just fine with this. I think I think what you have is acceptable. It's not great, but I think it's acceptable enough that I don't have to worry about like switching things. So I like it. All right, then let's double check and see if Emily has anything she does. She has some new stuff. Let's see, damage versus focus. So 15 damage versus is 25% hit chance, crit uh, chance. This effect ends the first time it gets a crit. Is that per turn or is that total? I don't think that's worth it, man. I think that's a one-time thing. I think like as soon as you get a crit hit, then it's gone, right? All right, you have disrupt, but this is da 10 damage plus disrupt. Oh, 30 damage, man. So uh, definitely take the 10 damage plus disrupt. And then we knew we didn't have any other armor. What are you using right now? You're doing all out, which I still think is absolutely great for you. Yeah. That blitz is going to be kind of nice. We might want to roll with that. Then Sid, you got some extra stuff. Two magazines plus one ammo. Oh, you actually aren't even using this. 
to Simeon. Oh, so we recruited someone that had something you didn't have. Okay, then. And then I'm assuming this is Simeon. Yeah, your, your stuff is crap. What happened? <laughs> Why do you have such bad stuff? Is this Simeon again? This is Augustus. What the hell? Well, thank God I recruited these people, man. <laughs> uh, you don't have a helmet. So we want to take this with Augustus. Yeah. Oh, maybe I gave Augustus your stuff. Maybe that's what happened. So then in that case... Yeah, I think I gave Augustus your stuff. I think that's what happened. And then we uh, got Simeon, who had some other stuff. I don't really care about 10% invasion. You're likely... I don't think that's where... I think the 10% invasion. The Blitz isn't super helpful. I think I'm just going to take the plus health on you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Blitz isn't going to be super useful. Then your self-repair, but I think we, these are better. 20 health, yeah, those are just strictly better. Okay, so then last but not least, we'll go over here to Marcella, who I always want to call Emily for some reason. <laughs> Emily 2 is what we should call you. Uh, accuracy bonus, nah, I'll keep patrol, because that one's legendary. And then 15 damage, yes please. And Edda, okay. And I think you already have the better stuff here. So, you know, we should have double-checked on pistols. Actually, yes. Uh, you are basically using the exact same stuff you had last turn. Yeah, 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 yeah. You have everything you need. I thought there was one other thing I was thinking about giving you, though. Yeah, but you already have the stim grenade one, which is what we wanted. So, sure, sure, sure. Uh, hi. You No, you do have the helmet. Does Emily have the helmet? Yeah, she does. It just isn't on. There you go. I like to keep it on just so I know. Whole case. So we need to collect all cases. I don't know if Emily's going to be particularly useful on this one. You could argue a sniper might be better. It's just going to depend on how much movement this there is. Helps. And she it's kind of hard to know ahead of time. More, but I've got a different gospel. Sink or swim. If you can't pull weight, don't expect pity. Because the grubs won't give you any. Now, it's proving time. Kind of cool area over here. Although I have to say, I mean, if there's one thing about Gears of War, it's like, everything doesn't feel futuristic. Like, from the weapons to the architecture, I don't sit here and be like, oh, this is a futuristic, you know, area. Trial right. by fire it is. If we're gonna tangle with Ukon, we need better armor and weapons. Grab the gear and watch out for those nemesis bombs. Okay, so this is actually a terrible mission for Emily. <laughs> giddy, giddy, good, good, good. This is gonna be terrible. So we actually are grabbing crates here, which is kind of awesome because we're gonna get a total of three cases at least and maybe even five. So is there just going to be a time limit on this one? Or what's going to happen? Now, she will get to move and, you know, keep her anchoring. But we'll have to see how useful that is. I, I kind of feel like this was a terrible mission to bring her on. Now we know. Collect cases. Do not bring heavies. This is totally okay. Those guys are big. So those, those bombs have to be coming a little on the slow side. I think. I think. Move it, cream pops. More bombs on the way. So we're not in range yet, so I'm just going to overwatch. And wide. then that's going to give I'm us our anchoring. Uh, I should probably put you in cover. That'll give us our anchoring. And then next turn we'll be able to run forward. And yeah, you just shotgun anyone that gets into they this final wave. I don't know if Emily's going to be able to get hit enough this way. I don't know. But luckily, they're all coming from here, so... Just give me as many anchors as possible. We're doing damage on the big guy, which, quite frankly, is necessary. Unfortunately, with having to run four, this is going to be a little crap. Now, this is the only potential problem here, is we kind of find ourselves in a bit of a weird spot. I wonder if I just run all the way up here. Waiting orders. I kind of wonder if I just want to run all the way up there. On it. Let's see how much damage we can do on you. This guy scares me. That is not as much damage as I would like to see. Just going to throw that out there. 
Oh, you're stim grenades. Ah, shoot, shoot, shoot. Well, I guess do as much damage as you can. I need, I need one of these guys dead. And I hate the fact that we're not gonna get any extra abilities. Oh, I can double shot you. You know what? With a potential crit on this, we might... Okay, that's what I was wondering. Unfortunately, we straight killed him, which kind of sucks. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Whoops. Because if we would have knocked him down, we could have, like, chopped him. Oh, the dog is right here. She wants me to come out. Um, Let's go ahead and intimidate you, actually. And hopefully he runs away. He's going to get extra damage received. But we're going to keep you here. But, uh, well, next turn I can shoot and then run. Hey, pup. No. No. I might have to put a pause in this episode. I might have to put a pause in this episode. Can I throw a grenade? You can't shoot. I can throw a grenade. A grenade that's going to do an extra 20% damage. So. All right. That's not bad. I can live with that. Could have potentially also ran up and planted a grenade. How many more actions do we have? Just one. So now we got to end our turn then. Okay, let's end this turn and then I'm going to put a pause in here, unfortunately. Hi. Don't hurt. Oh, that hurt. That hurt. That hurt. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm going to put a quick pause in here and we'll be back in one second. I'll see you, everyone. Okay, went and had lunch. Dog got a bone. I think she's chewing the bone right now, so I think we're fine. So, all right, so the question is, are the bombs going to fall before they get to act on their turn? In which case, we could just uh, ignore him as is. But the thing is, I think it might be a good idea for us to shoot him. Target obstructed. Oh, we're going to hit both of our people. Um, I still think this is a good idea, though, because if we can down him, we can potentially get the kill from them, and then uh, we can get some XP. So you took quite a bit of damage. You are not the healer. You are... Who are you, by the way? This is Sid. Oh. Ah. I st yep. still think we'll move Sid over here for now. She okay. took her bone and she's in the bathroom with the bone. Okay, good, 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 good. Uh, are you still obstructed? Yes, you are. So then in that case, let's go ahead and move Emily. We're going to end up losing her anchor points no matter what. Luckily, he doesn't do damage to us running past him. All right, so now I want to go ahead, shotgun you, which will hopefully put him on the ground. Okay, the kill works. I'd almost rather him been on the ground because then I could have gotten extra ability for everyone. And then we got to take you with all your remaining movements over here. I would like to also have reloaded, but we'll have to live with that. And then you are going to come up here and you're going to go two as well. And we're going to go use you to heal Sid. Now, where are these other cases, by the way? There's one over there. I don't think we're going to get that one. We only need three. I think we can get that. I might just go for three. I don't know, man. I feel like our gear's pretty dang good at this point. And, like, it's just... Here's the problem. It's such a randomized thing. Like, if we knew we were going to get something useful, okay. But the thing is, we might not get anything useful. All right, that sucks. <laughs> that, that's terrible. Uh, and it doesn't look like they actually get to act first, so I'm glad that we shotgunned him. This will be good. Uh -huh. How do we want to do this? It's two to actually get up there. Oh, this is bad, guys. We might. We might just run away here. Now, you have the ability to run. Where is it? Here. How far of a run can you go? Quite a bit. So I think we take two, but then you're not going to be able to run away. Heavy on standby. <sighs> this is one turn. I think Emily has to do it just because she's right here. Okay. I, I think we you honestly are going to have to run away. Somewhere less explosive. And I think we go here and just hide. This is full cover, so he's not they're not going to be able to do that much damage against us. I wish that we had your interrupt ability, because that would be so nice to have right about now. Can we get right here? No, but we can get here with Sid. 
I will be able to uh, throw a grenade at them next turn, which is going to do a ton of damage because of all... Actually, nope, 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 nope. That's a shotgun chick that has the grenade ability. Eh. So we'll do something like that just so we don't accidentally shoot you. Don't care so much about the overwatch, but it's just the extra damage. Then you're going to be able to come here, and we'll have to reload with you because then potentially next turn we can kill these guys if we so choose. Reload. Now the question is, do I want to move you up here and go grab this? Can we get up here far enough to avoid taking damage? Well, okay, it explodes, but then what stops us from running through their next turn? Not a lot, other than the fact that... Other than the fact that it seems highly likely we're not going to be able to run. <laughs> Unless we get some executions. I really honestly think you need to get some executions to get all five cases. Oh, they're going to run away? Oh, that's a sniper! Try again, Grub. Did he hit me? That actually didn't do nearly as much damage as it gave me the impression. Wait, does it not do damage here? Yep. Yeah, I don't think we took any damage on that. All right, well, we're just going to go for the third case. We might go this way, but I'm not going to worry too much about it. I just, I want to stay safe. That's more my concern here. Okay. Okay. Emily, you come up here. Might as well get you as far forward as possible. Sid must survive. Be hilarious if Sid died. You know, after all the talk in the beginning about like, you need to be such a good player and blah, 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 blah. And then he goes and dies. Um, I'm gonna go here, even though it's gonna put us in a weird spot. Dude, I do not like the fact that there are multiple potential snipers here. Ah, that's a stim grenade. I think we're just gonna overwatch this way on the off oh, chance no, that something I'm comes down that way. Cause I don't really know what else we're gonna do. Um. Okay, one thing we have is we have the run ability. So if I take one move out here, On the move. and then we take a straight run here, crap, we screwed this up. We should have gone forward a little bit more. We could go here. The question is whether or not the shotgun, because like we got the double shot possibility and we also have the grenades. So we have a lot of potential just murder chance here. I'm really hoping this is gonna do, yeah, okay. As long as it kills, that's what I was hoping for. Let's do this just to guarantee a kill. Oh, I can always just stealth her. That's true. Yeah. My concern was the fact that we we're going to have trouble potentially running away next time. But the fact that I can just uh, 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 silence, or sorry, go stealthy, I think is fine. 47, 10%. So, nah, we'll keep this gun and we will do this just on the off chance that someone runs at you. The dog wants to go out the front door. <laughs> sorry, pup. All right, they're shooting at us. I'm okay with that. He hunkered. This is a little more suckage. No, Parker. Uh, uh, I love you, dog. I love you so much. Okay, I'm gonna go get her another bone, apparently. So we'll be back in one second. Hey. All right, all right, all right, all right. This is gonna be hard, though. Mostly because these guys are all right on top of each other. I should have saved her grenade. I'm really wishing we would have. Really wishing we would have. We could plan a grenade. I could cloak and run up here, which would make her safe. I mean, I just don't know how we're gonna do damage on these people. Um, Sid has a grenade. Or is this the healing? That's a frag grenade. So this is gonna be about the only chance we have of hurting these guys. Like, this is kind of an awkward situation. The other thing we could do is potentially just murder that guy, execute him. I'm hoping, oh shoot, I was actually worried about this. Ah, I was worried about this. All right, so in this case, guess what? We're gonna do this and chase them all away. Uh -huh. So did the Intimidate do much for us? Uh, not particularly. Can I get into a spot where I can shoot? 
Doesn't look like it. What about you, Emily? They actually... It's just gonna take... They can't see us here, which is the irony. Where's this case? It's right there. So what we could do... <clears throat> We could go here, actually. This is a possibility. Because remember, we do have disrupt. So if they're going to come and hit us, we shoot them, and then we disrupt them, and then they don't get to shoot us. I think that actually works for us. Then you're going to also come two of three. Yeah, I think this is our best bet. Now, what can they shoot us from there? I have no idea. But we're trying also not to whack Sid here, which is a bit of a problem. Um... I'm going to go up here. That's probably a bad idea because she's going to have to run all the way around. And we're just going to go ahead and cloak herself. Now, what about this guy? That guy's in dead range, so... This is really awkward, by the way. Yeah, he can see us. Shoot. This one, luckily... Okay, that helped. That was nice. That saved us. And we can execute him, which is also potentially good. Now, Sid could be in a bad spot here. Sid is in a bad spot, but we survived. He hunkered. Totally okay. Goodbye. <laughs> okay, there is a lot of red going on here. Alrighty then. Um, so, here's the problem. I need to throw a grenade with him. Okay. I can't throw a grenade with him because... I'm listening. She has a grenade back. Oh my god, so clutch. So clutch. Can we get up here with two of three? Uh, I, I can't freaking see what's happening here. So she actually is going to have to run all the way up here to not die. Great. I don't think... That's okay. This actually is fine for us. Okay, okay. So there's only one more Overwatch, it looks like. Yeah, there's only one more Overwatch. And can we explode that Overwatch? I think what we can do is we can throw a grenade here. That'll interrupt the Overwatch. Rag going out. So we interrupted the overwatch. Now you're telling me there's no overwatch left, right? I'm pretty sure that's what you're telling me. So then we're gonna run up here and execute. Which is gonna give everyone else an extra ability. Now can uh, Marcella do this? Can you get an execution here on three? No, it's gonna require all four. So in that case, I think we're gonna use Emily because she's crap at shooting anyways. And we're gonna go execute. Lost the anchor, doesn't matter. I wasn't gonna not use the anchor here. <laughs> That's a great execution. So that gives Sid another ability. Question is, do I wanna use Sid for the kill here? Maybe. Okay, so now Emily, sorry, not Emily, Marcella can get up here. She actually has five. I need to down you. You have two. I'm gonna take one shot here. The hope is we can execute him again. Yes! That's exactly what we were hoping for. Okay, so now we have another extra ability here. Good, 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 good. Uh, do we want to execute with you now? Because that's your last ability. So then with you, we're gonna come execute. That's gonna give everyone an extra ability. Get murdered. Punk. Does she... She still has two abilities Is left. Is Sid the only one injured? No. So let's go ahead and group therapy. Just give everyone a little bit more HP. Emily took some damage too. Yeah, that's right from the Overwatch. Okay. Scout reporting. Then Scout reporting for duty. This is three. 
Let's the start combat. here on three. And we're going to want a grenade, and we're probably going to want a double shot. My thinking is... I don't know we have a good chance now. 10%, we can't even see the other guy. Okay, so then in that case, grenade here is a straight kill. You have three actions left. Let's do a grenade kill here. I don't care about execution. Then we're going to move... Here to get as wide of an angle as possible and we're gonna double shoot you 83% chance to hit on both of them and we yeah. hit Okay, wow. we got it. We got it. Yeah, yeah, that got a little sketchy there, but we we totally fine And then yeah, yeah let's go ahead and open. I think we still have another action left too minimum reached. You want to impress me grab the rest Otherwise, um, get to the evac point. I think we're gonna go for the evac point <laughs> I think we're gonna go evac point. I, I'm not here to impress you anymore. All right, so you still, who is this? I can't even see. This is Sid, I think. I almost feel like we should just reload. I mean, I don't know. I kind of feel like, do we think there's gonna be more guys? Understood. I'm gonna say no. I'm gonna say there's probably not gonna be more guys. I love how you're anchored when you weren't even in cover. It seems a little weird, but that's okay. So you think that one hits us if we are in it? All right, I'm hoping we can hop over this. Acknowledged. Right? I'm listening. Eyes up. Evac points in range. Uh, moving out. Yep. That wasn't what was supposed to happen. I thought I had Sid there. Oh, crap. Is this a one hit kill? I thought this was Sid. I mm, I can't do anything about this, can I? We're about to just lose her. If this is a one-hit kill, we're dead. Oh, thank God. Okay. We completely screwed that up. We completely screwed that up. Because the thing is, I have the run on her, which is the thing that's like completely BS about this. Uh, all right, so we got to get you right here. I think everyone can get to the I'm exit sure. except potentially you. I'm assuming here you just exit. Waiting orders. This is a really crappy mission, by the way. Awaiting orders. Is Emily going to take some damage here, or is this our other? Who is this? This is not Emily. This is our other support. So we can't hop. No, you're going to just take extra damage, too. Hopefully they leave. The... So I'm thinking we're all just going to take a bunch of damage again here. So that's probably going to knock down my support chick, which there's not much I can do about that. Uh, this unit gets three actions. This unit cannot shoot. Oh, yeah, we knew about redeploy. Uh, let's just, you know, because they're going to pop down at us. Let's just, like, come over here. Setting up a perimeter. Oh, this sucks. So she's going to get knocked down, but we'll be able to pick her back up. We don't have time for this. No, really. Someone get him up. Really? Wow. That almost killed all of us for the record. Yeah. On my way. Do we need to pick you up now? Okay, we're good. You got a long damn Boy, that was a terrible mission for the record. I don't like that one. I don't like that one. That one seems like a step above in difficulty level than all the others. That's crazy. I love how we're being shot at and not like explosions happening, but whatever. So we got what, three rare cases? Sure. Uh, and then we got a hair trigger and extra crit chance. Cool. Congratulations. So I would assume probably side mission next, although probably cutscene first, perhaps. Or not. We also didn't really get many kills on this mission either, which is kind of the crap thing about it. Yeah, Marcella got close, but like. 
Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Only eleven total kills. Okay, give me my crates, please. Uh, all right, that's fine. Is that critical hit resistance? Stabilizers, always nice. And accuracy bonus. Okay, well, in the scheme of things, those are fine. Uh, barracks. I don't think there's any new troops we care about. I don't care about leveling those guys yet, and we are maxed out on everyone. So what's our next mission? Next mission is a rescue mission, AWOL. Complete the mission in 15 turns or less, and we get a couple things. And I imagine this is the main mission, so we can take all of our people. Is Emily and Michaela forced on this one? Gabe and Sid are banned, but then we need Michaela and two other units. Now, the only thing about this is complete the mission in 15 turns or less. I don't think we want to take a heavy. Yeah, I'm fairly certain we're not going to want a heavy on this one. So we'll probably want Vanguard uh, with Augustus. We're going to want our Scout Marcella. And then probably Melane, Melanie. I think is going to be our best option here. Yeah. Yeah. I think so. But anyways, hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, drop a like, comment. Let me know what you think. As always, hit the subscribe button, join the game, comment, share your support. I'll see you guys next episode. Later, everybody.